Okay, so now we want to apportion 70 seats to these five states, um, using Webster's method and the Huntington Hill method. So, we'll start out in our usual way of by finding the divisor. So we'll take the total population, divide it by the number of seats to come up with the, uh, divisor. Uh, and from that, we can calculate our quotas. And now we'll go ahead and make our initial allocation. Now in Webster's method, remember that we round each of these to the nearest value. Uh, so we'll round this to 34, this to 23, this to 6, this to 4, and this to 2. Uh, and now if we add those up, um, hmm. We only got 69 representatives, uh, which means we're going to need to try a new divisor. Uh, now in order to get this, uh, number larger, we're gonna need a smaller divisor. So let's go ahead and round our divisor down to, let's try 8700 and see what happens. Uh, so let's see, if I do that, let's calculate out my new quotas here. So there's the new quotas under this new divisor. And let's see what the allocations would look like then. So this one will round up now. That one, uh, will round up. That one will round up. That one will round down. That one will round down. Uh, and so now we get our 70 seats allocated as we were hoping for. Uh, and so at this point, Webster's method is, is done. Okay, so this right here is, is the result of Webster's method. And so now let's go and use Huntington Hill's method. So Huntington Hill method would have started out the same way, coming up with this, uh, quota. But then once we had the quota, we would have found the lower quotas and the geometric means. Remember, by taking the, the, square root of, like here, 34 times 35, uh, and let me see if I can get those down here, uh, 2.449, uh, roughly. Uh, so then the initial allocation here comes from comparing the quota to the geometric mean. So here the quota is less than the geometric mean. Here the quota is bigger than the geometric mean. Here the quota is bigger. Here the quota is smaller. And here the quota is bigger, and so we would round up. If we total those up, we get, uh, 70 seats. Uh, and this is the result of Huntington Hill method. Now you'll notice that these two results are different. Uh, in this case, the, the, under Huntington Hill method, the smaller state E, uh, got the extra seat, uh, whereas under Webster's method, uh, state A ended up getting that extra seat.